Greg Tepper, Dave Campbell's Texas Football and TexasFootball.com here at the HEB Classic 7-on-7 State Qualifying Tournament here. Celebrities all over the place. <laughs> Jeff Fleener, new head coach of the Mesquite Skeeters. Coach, last time we talked to you, uh, you had pretty much been on the job for 15 minutes. That's You've right. been on there a little bit longer than 15 minutes. Uh, what's changed? Uh, you, you, you feeling good about the, the decision you've made to come here? Oh, absolutely. It's uh, it, It's been a dream decision now, uh, just looking at what we had. You know, that's the great thing about the Mesquite was the cupboard wasn't bare. We've got some great athletes, got some great young talent, uh, just getting everybody going in the right direction. A lot, of, a lot of juice, a lot of energy going on right now, which is exciting. So uh, we got a lot of work to do this summer, but we're definitely excited to get there for that first game. Speaking of summer, you're out here at the 7-on-7 seven seven tournament as a fan. Uh, you can't coach. Do you, do you wish Do you wish you could? Do you, you kind of have to bite your tongue out here? A little bit. You, you don't want them to get any bad habits, and that's that's what gets bad when they don't let us coach them a little bit. You don't want the bad habits and quarterbacks patting the ball and running around and guys you know, freelancing a little too much. And so you, you'd like to have a little bit of control over it, but uh, it is what it is, and we do the best we can. So what do you want to see out here? When you're watching your team go out there and compete against some, some really quality teams in this tournament, what do you want to see uh, from your kids? Biggest thing, like you said, just how do they compete? How do they handle different situations? You know, when things are going good, how do they handle it? When things are going bad, how do they handle it? Uh, you know, especially when you're coming in a, as a new coach, you really haven't seen them. You know, we saw them all spring, but as far as in a competition against other teams, how do they handle when things aren't going their way? And I know that you've told me before we started that you're really excited about some of the youngsters you're going to have out there. You know, you've been pointing out, you're saying that kid's a sophomore, you know, that kid's a, you know, that, you know, these kids are going to be underclassmen. Um, uh, it, it's safe to say that, uh, you know, you said the cupboard is is, is, is far from bare. Safe to say that it's 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 pretty pretty full for the next few years. Uh, absolutely, we, do. we like the talent that we have coming up. You know, it's all relative when you play in the district we play in with the the Long Views and the John Tyler's and the Rock Walls and all the other Mesquite schools. So, I mean, they're going to have good young talent also. But it's just exciting. You know, I think right now we'll probably start seven guys on defense that are only going to be juniors, uh, which is going to be a whole lot of fun because they're they're great athletes. They're just going to have to grow up fast. Um, you know, and then on offense have some great young skill guys. So, real excited about the the young guys coming up and uh, and blending them with those seniors. Got some great senior leaderships from uh, from our safety. Katie Hartfield and our linebacker uh, Devion Smith that you know have been in the fire before so they're going to be able to grow those guys up a little bit so you know like I said just love being back up here love being around these young kids and uh, we're just ready to go see us compete. Uh, we're ready to see you compete too. Jeff Fleener, Coach of Mesquite. Coach appreciate your time. Appreciate it. Thanks.